Ah, see? The boat washed ashore. Someone did call a serpent earlier. Nope. Still kinked. Get in. I will pull. You are quiet. Are you not better? I guess. I know you overheard my talk with Freya. You think you understand, but you do not. Why do you say nothing? You said I was cursed. You think I'm weak because I'm not like you. I know I was never what you wanted. But after all this, I thought maybe things were different. You do not know everything, boy. No. But at least I know the truth now. The truth? The truth. I am a god, boy. From another land far from here. When I came to these shores, I chose to live as a man. But the truth is, I was born a god, and so were you. Boy, have you nothing to say? Um, can I turn into an animal? Can you turn into an animal? No. No, I do not think so. I'm a god. Mother knew? She was a god too? No. She was mortal, but she knew my true nature. I'm a god. Why did you wait so long to tell me? and tragedy. That is the curse. Hmm. What sorts of things can I do? Can I fly? Or turn invisible? I don't feel like a god. I do not know the reach of your godhood. But over time, you will learn. You sure I can't turn into a wolf? You are welcome to surprise me. Is this why I hear voices sometimes? Are you sure you've never heard any? Not as you do. That's no surprise. Every god is unique. So, maybe I won't get strong like father, but I'll have abilities all my own? You already do, laddie. Your faculty for language is extraordinary for one so young. Time alone will tell what else you'll become capable of. So you knew all along? I did, lad. But I've known more than my share of gods. Me too, apparently. I wonder who else knew I was a god. Freya, for sure. Brock and Sindri? They do not need to know. <gasps> Boulder! Does he know? Is that why he's after us? Do you know him from before? The day of your mother's funeral was the first I ever saw Balder. That is the truth. Hey, we don't have to go right back to Pierre's vault, do we? I mean, we're God. We can do whatever we want, right? What do you really feel like doing right now? I will show you. Let's try this again, without interruptions. Oh, here we go again. Read it. Death itself I swallow. To spring forth life tomorrow. Oh, I like that one. I wonder if I wrote it. It 
Is that the answer there? It says Earth. Hmm, swallows death, brings forth life. Go. Yeah. I wish I'd known I was a god in Alphon. I wouldn't have felt so bad about killing so many elves. Well, I'm not sure that's the lesson. You've done nothing to regret. The elves forced their affairs upon us. No, I get it now. We had god things to do, and they were in the way, dragging us into their little problems. Again, are we just leaving that there? I mean, just knowing we're gods makes me feel so much stronger. Maybe you feel a little too good right now. With power comes a big choice, lad. You can either serve yourself, or put your godhood in the service of others, like Tyr did. People really loved him, huh? Aye. A god of war, but one who fought for peace. Had a reputation for being heroic and lawful, using his power and knowledge to stop wars rather than start them. So there are good gods. Once in a moon it's been known to happen, yes? This one mentions places I've never heard of. Seems Tyr really liked to travel. Tyr believed the mind, not might, was key to preventing war and chaos. And he also knew visiting other cultures would give him perspective staying in one place could not. While Odin always hoarded knowledge, guarding it jealously, Tyr was open and sharing with his learning and his wisdom. For this, mortals adored Tyr, showing their love by bringing him gifts the world over. So, whatever happened to Tyr? Odin came to regard him as a threat to his rule. He suspected Tyr of collaborating to aid the giants instead of helping to steal their secrets for the Aesir. Same thing he accused me of, frankly. Though in Tyr's case, I believe he was right. You think Tyr was helping the giants? I do. He felt responsible for the suffering visited upon them by Odin. I suspect he had something to do with helping them cover their tracks. The missing Jotunheim town. Correct. Whatever happened to it, I believe it could only have been done with Tyr and the Giants working together. Where is this black? Don't know. I've never been in here. The stone! That has to be it! Atreus didn't think it would be that easy. No. Rather, a trap for the winds of hell. But where do you think the winds are? The winds of what? Oh, we forgot to mention that. When you were sick, we went to Helheim to get your cure. You did? Terrible experience, by the by. Your da picked up a new trick, though, with a little help from Brock. Brock was there, too? I... but... We'll get back to the... <laughs> That's unfriendly. Look, small passages on either side. Perfect for the boy. Too small for father. Go. That will be fine.
Bear's not here to bring you back if you're happy to. Quiet. What'd you find? Enough distraction. Do not forget why we are here. Okay. Not as simple as that, I'm afraid. It is not important. It was a rash impulse. You need not dwell on my failings. I guess you do like to smash pottery. Ha!
Look, I just want to know the truth from now. Okay? I don't care if it hurts me or not. I want to learn. Just because you hate being a god doesn't mean I have to. More small passages. I know. Go. I can't watch, brother. Good luck. Oh. Saws were scary. Look! It's the wolf giants. Skull and Hati. That's right. The bringers of day and night. Ragnarok begins when they catch the sun and moon. Right? Did Tyrna live? I don't know. Like them well enough to cover a massive wall in his vault with them, though. Don't you enjoy it at all? Being a god? On an adventure in some amazing place? Maybe Mother wanted us to have a little fun. Everything we've seen and done. Maybe it was her gift. I don't see another trap for the... Uh... Winds of Hell? Maybe we can get up to one of those balconies for a better look. What of these? Thought is faster than wind. Hmm. Perhaps this isn't about speed at all. Is there someplace else the winds can go? You know, for someone so loved, Tyr sure was paranoid. Aye. Thanks to Odin, with good reason.
slower. Ah. What's going on? Trap. Father. Boy, get out of here. I'm fine. How do we get you out? Pull chains on the wall. But there are three of them. What do I do? Atreus, focus. You can do this. Please hurry. I don't know yet if I can drown. Okay, think. Hati's the silver one. He hunts them. Skull's gold and he chases the sun. For Ragnarok to happen, they have to eat them. But these are out of order. Good boy. So the moon goes on the left, sun on the right. With Midgard in the middle, but which bar do I pull? Middle bar! Left! Middle bar! Gotta get them in order. Moon left, sun right. With Midgard in the middle. Right! Left, boy! Moon on the left, sun on the right. Midgard in the middle. Middle bar! Pull the right! That's something. We're not stopping! Wait! What is that big chain for? Father! Above me! Boy! You have to stop that chain! How? I... I do not know. To do? Uh, a knife? There's no other way! It's not working! That should have worked! saved you. That was cunning, boy. The road's free! I think we did it! Aye. Let's go see what Tears got for us. No. Raised protection room. What should we do? We keep... There it is! We've got it! Boy. Yeah. On the day you were born, I made two knives. Mixing metals from my home and from this land. One for myself. And when you were ready, one for you. Today is that day. So I'm a man now. Like you? No. We are not men. We are more than that. The responsibility is far greater. be better than me. Understand? Say it. I will be better. The power of this weapon, any weapon, comes from here. But only when tempered by this, by the discipline, the self-control of the one who wields it. That is where the true strength of a warrior lies. You must never forget that. Good then. Come.
blank. <laughs> Wait! The rune! Did you see it? Yes! Are you certain? I got it! Trust me! Good then. Aim for the face. <laughs> I'm turned around. Which way is the sandball back up? We're so close to the end. Wine. 
the island of Lemnos, near the place of my birth. End. Really? It smells like rotten eggs. Is it still good? Possibly. Father, why did you leave your home and come here? Does it have to do with the other gods there? Hmm. It's just, you hate the gods so much. But Tyr proves that gods can be good. And you're good. You only killed those deserving, right? Yes. Ah. But who's worthy enough to judge? Quiet, Head. We are. We know better. Huh? Sounding more like your da by the moment. Ready. Ready. Come. I think I'm gonna like being a god. Having learned that travel rune to Jotunheim, we can now head back to the gateway on top of the peak and put that magic chisel to good use. Nobody's getting our way this time. Come on. Ah, oh, I can read what this says now. But it's a name. Rota! Whoa! The name made it light up! It's the name of one of the Valkyries. That's quite curious. I'm gonna tell Sindra I'm gone. I'd like to see the look on his face. No. I may have kept your secret too long. But now you will keep our secret. Huh. I can read these now. It says Muspahan. The Fire Realm. Is the gauntlet of the sewer share. Like, a magic glove? Or a series of dangers. We should go see sometime. Our young god knows no fear. Why should we hide where we are? Secrets are Odin's way. Shouldn't we be open? Like Tyr? Tyr kept secrets too, for good reasons. To protect people. It is wiser to be discreet. That doesn't mean you should lie to your friends. Or your family. I'm sure Sindri would understand. So what? Excited to finally see the land of the giants? Yeah, but also sad the journey's almost over. Oh, what if we get to Jotunheim and there aren't any giants there either? Makes little difference to us. Fulfilling your mother's wish is what is important. Ah! Oh, don't go anywhere. Be with you in two shakes. Father, can I tell him? No. Tell me what? Did you put this wheel in your mouth? Oh, God. I I'll vomit. I I'm not kidding. I'll throw up on it. It is nothing. A family matter. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, I can tell you a thing or two about family matters. Oh, oh. Let me guess. Your brother isn't as talented as you, and his work is junk. 
Um, those things are accurate. Your point? It's all you ever talk about, over and over. Do something about it or shut up already. I see. Yeah! We're sick of hearing about little people's little problems! Um... All right. That hurt a little. Let's have a look at your gear then. Guarantee you'll like my work today. You sure you wouldn't prefer Brock help you instead? 